Okay, it looks like it's stable. I'm just gonna go through some adjustments here. I think that is okay like that. My signal seems to be good. It is snowy though, so. All right, everybody, welcome to another Friday Cochrane Alberta Weekend Events Roundup. I am Samantha from Urban Casual, and we have a lot on the go this weekend, Cochrane. I'm going to uh, mention a few things first, just so that they're at the top and we can all focus on those things. Um, we have Elevate Cochrane, uh, the health and wellness weekend coming up next week in Cochrane, and you need a ticket to that. So you should go online and grab one now, or all of the fun is going to be all signed up for. And um, yeah, you don't want to leave that till last minute. It's a great event and uh, one that's definitely worth being visited. So head over to uh, their page. I'll drop the link in here so that you can get your ticket super easy. And that is for next weekend, the 4th, 5th, and 6th. Lots of fun events um, are included in that ticket. Um, and it's a great way to check out uh, some Cochrane businesses and find out what they're doing in the health and wellness space. I will be there on the Friday evening. I am sponsoring the We Are Cochrane event. And I'm super excited to align with um, this event because uh, storytelling is really um, what brings community together. So I'm looking forward to these um, presenters on the evening and uh, looking forward to hearing them share their stories. All right. Secondly, it is Halloween coming up soon. I know it's weeks away, right? Why are we thinking about it? Well, we're thinking about it because it's um, there's actually a few really great Halloween themed events that are happening in Cochrane. Uh, they are all on. Let me just move ahead here. I don't want to get the date wrong. Uh, October 26th. So on Saturday, October 26th, there are two events going on in town that have a Halloween theme. And you will want to get a ticket to these right away because they are limited number of seats and um, they, well, the one is super fun and the other one is cheaper right now. So if you wait till the day of, the price does go up. So go pop over and get your ticket for those events now. So the first event is the Jelly Bean Dance. Uh, we had one of these back in May and it was so much fun that we're doing it again. So the Heritage Hills Community Association has been busy planning. Um, the Bow Valley Credit Union has sponsored the event and it will be held at Spray Lakes um, from 6 p.m. until 8 p.m. It's still $5 for a child. Uh, that includes pizza and uh, games and lots of dancing fun. Uh, everybody is welcome to come in a costume. You uh, may leave children ages 8 to 12. You may leave them um, at the check-in system and come back for them at 8 o'clock. But if you want to bring kids younger than 8, um, a parent does need to stay to supervise those. But like I said, it was a super fun event in May when we did it. And it's going to be so much bigger, like huge. You have no idea. So if you came to the last one, grab your kids some tickets now. I will put the Eventbrite link up on this post so that you can grab them and have them uh, before Halloween comes because it's going to be the thing to do that Saturday night. And if you're looking for an adult event, Masquerade 2019 is back. That will be at the Lions Event Center. Um, the tickets are only $30 right now, but like I said, the price does go up to $40. So go grab your tickets for that event right now, and I will pop the event bright, bright link in here as well. We have our photo of the week contest. We are in week three. We are congratulating uh, Shanna and um, Play Outside Kremers from Instagram for her wicked photo. Um, there is a great sky, awesome kid on a bike. It just was an amazing photo. It took away all the votes and uh, she is the winner of week two. But we do have more photos uh, up for week three. So you can head over to Instagram or Facebook and um, pop your vote in there now to tell us which picture you like best. And next week, October 1st, 
that will be a Tuesday evening. Uh, we are having a political debate in Cochrane. So from what I'm told, it will happen at the Cochrane Alliance Church at 7 p.m. All five uh, political leaders will be in attendance. So if you wanna know more about each of the parties, their platforms and what they stand for, you will want to come out to this event. It is free. Uh, like I said, starts at 7 p.m. on Tuesday night at the Cochrane Alliance Church and all five political parties will be there to represent. And um, this is a great chance for you to find out uh, more about them and uh, what they do and what they want to do for us nationally. And um, definitely uh, pop into that next Tuesday night if you have some questions that you would like answered. All right, so this weekend in Alberta, it is Alberta Culture Days. So that means in Cochrane, there are quite a few fun things going on uh, to do. And I encourage everybody to get out and check them out. There are three days worth of events. We kicked off the first part starting at 11 today. And um, that's Cochrane Culture Days, for dancing and music until 3 p.m. today. All right, and uh, starting at 6 p.m., there's a fundraiser tonight for Big Hill Haven. It is called A Night in the Wild West. Now, there are some tickets still available for this. It's $40. Um, that includes dancing, dinner, and uh, all the fun, and that'll be happening at the Texas Gate. Lots of Eventbrite link going into this post, so I'm, I'm going to put all of the ticket links in here so that you don't have trouble going to buy them, okay? So that is tonight, and that should be a fun time at the Texas Gate. 6.30 p.m., you can hit up the Legion for its weekly barbecue. 8 p.m., Killarney's has karaoke. And at 9 p.m., the venue has its worldwide debut of Rouge. Now, tomorrow, lots on the go. All right, so you got to stay with me here. Starting at 9 a.m., the Cochrane Comet Swim Club will be spreading out all over Cochrane and they are doing a bottle drive. So if you're not going to be home, feel free to leave um, your bottles on your porch or out in front of your garage and the kids from the swim team can grab them. They will be coming out uh, starting at 9 o'clock and finishing up around 1130. So if you have any bottles that you can donate to their uh, fundraiser, that would be great. And uh, they start that at 9 a.m. tomorrow. At 9.30 a.m., the farmer's market is back for, I believe it's last week. I am not totally 100% sure on that, but I believe it's the last weekend. And um, I will uh, let you all know if that's not correct. But there should be one more, and that's tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. At 10 a.m., the Tangled Tree Baby and Tot Market is at the Frank Wills Hall. So if you have any uh, baby and tot items that you uh, are looking for, this is a great chance to uh, snag some of that stuff at the Frank Wills Memorial Hall. And at 11, Cochrane Culture Days starts up again. I'll pop the link into there. There's lots of things on the go for this, so you're going to have to visit the link and... Um, find out exactly what it is that you want to do with Cochrane Culture Days. But that starts at 11. And at noon, heading over to Heartland tomorrow, we have some grand opening of some new show homes, some brand townhomes. They have two new show homes opening. And there will be waffles and Cochrane Coffee Trader coffee uh, for free at their event. So if you're looking for a new house or you want to check out their new show homes, that is happening at noon. Uh, 6.30 p.m. The venue has a really great event. Um, again, I'm going to give you the ticket link because tickets are involved. It's uh, I'm not sure on the price, but it does include dinner. And um, the dueling piano kings are generally one of the best um, one of the best events of the year. Um, there's generally two dueling piano events in Cochrane and they both sell out, but I believe there are still tickets available for tomorrow night and that'll be happening at the venue. And at 7 p.m., full day in Cochrane, Half Hitch is having its third annual Oktoberfest. Tickets for that are $10. Um, you can pick them up at Half Hitch directly or you can pay at the door. And at 8 p.m., Killarney's has named that tune. All right, Sunday. 
hopefully we all make it through the weekend without tons of snow. Um, I think in our area we're going to get 5 to 10 centimeters. Let's hope it stays a little bit more on the wet side. I don't know that I'm totally ready for it in my life just yet, but I don't make the weather, so I just go with it. Sunday morning, um, 11 a.m., the Cochrane Culture Days continue on, so be sure to check out their link and see exactly what they have on the go. At 1 p.m., you can head to the Lion Event Center for the Cochrane Culture Fest. So this will be ongoing all afternoon, and uh, it'll be um, quite the event. Uh, so you can pop over to that uh, starting at 1 p.m. I think it's on till 5, and that's at the Lion Event Center. And finishing off the weekend, 5 p.m., the venue has Sunday Jam. I think that is everything. I feel like I'm forgetting something. I feel like I'm forgetting something. If I've forgotten something, I will include it in the write-up. And um, I hope everybody has a great weekend. And I will see you around. Bye.